here we go. Masters number 26. Isn't that something? So, the first thing you may notice is that we seem to be missing one hat and one beautiful face. And you're right, Album is sadly not with us. So, we'll be flying solo this time. And you know, I know it, it's very hard to replace uh, him. I'll do what I can. Well, you know, may maybe not so much replace, but try to keep the same level of awesome without him present. But, we're gonna try our best, right? So, uh, this master's theme is the new and improved Divine Offering. Well, specifically, uh, the fact that it's basically been fixed? Pretty much, right? At, at the very least, the, it, the, 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 the frequency in which you would be, uh, D.O. screwed, as we often say, has been drastically reduced. And you basically have to miss D.O. twice in a row. And then you can just use then you then you're basically forced to use the ancient shrine or what have you. And then you still only lose a card. Assuming you only had one copy, so we'll see. So, anyways, let's get down to business. Where are we at here? We got 13 out of the 16. I do have the list with me. A uh, Holyo. Oh, Holyo made it. Okay. So he was one of the people that wasn't in uh, at first. But we've got him now. So the the lineup is kind of kind of interesting. Where there's some, um, gosh, where's that list? Did I lose it again? Oh, there it is. So as far as newcomers, well, there's a lot of old faces as you would expect. We've got Jodo. Uh, Kind of making a return. He's been on and off randomly. Vanguard and Cruel Tech rounding out our big guys. And then, of course, uh, you know, Holyo, Lyris, and Duel are also among the big guys. And then, as far as the n so sort of new people, Disp Despair? Uh, I've, I don't think I've ever seen that name. Potson we've seen before, but No Core is another name I'm not familiar with in particular. So this will definitely help me put together the new teams. So since I don't have album here, I'm gonna go back to the old format of I pick three teams: Team Titan of who I think are the most likely to win, Team Fuzz or you know my favorite so to speak, and then the underdog team. Of the uh, the new guys is always composed of the newest players. So let's do that real quick. We have a, we still have a, qu a couple minutes left, so we'll uh, we'll do that real quick. So this will be pretty obvious. Titan uh, should be pretty straightforward with Jodo, Cruel. Um, where are we at? Vanguard. Oh, he's not here yet. Well, I assume he'll come. If he doesn't come, well, I guess they get to be sad for a while, but not much I can do about it. And we'll throw in, I guess, Lyris. For the fuzzy team, gotta go after these guys with Duel, Hall Y'all. Hmm. Not that much to choose from. Oh, maybe, 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 maybe they'll do for now. We'll put Potson, Smoke. That's another new name. Despair, and what else is the lowest level here? I guess Darth Shaker. Of the people that are here. Well, we still gotta put two more people on Team Fuzz. Oh, Sandolphin. There you go. And we'll finish that off with... 
Alright, let's put in Andreola. There's our teams. Six minutes to go. Oh yeah! And the book was changed, right? The, bo the book of brokenness has been changed and is now the book of reasonable balancedness. Oh, ra oh, rain zone's in it? Hang on a second. How did I miss rain zone? Rain zone is obviously going on Team Fuzz. So Andreola's getting kicked. Whoops, my bad. I seem to have I seem to have missed him for some reason. Even though he was there right in front of me, right in the middle of the screen. So, there you go. The updated Team Fuzz now has rain zone in it. <laughs> That's all right. Fuzz can't. Well, Fuzz can read. Just Fuzz sometimes misses things right in front of his face. That's what it is. So uh, three people still missing. Vanguard being the most prestigious of the three, but he has missed Masters in the past, usually for one reason or another. So hope you know Team Titan is just gonna be down to three people if they don't get Vanguard. Sorry, guys. Uh, they're not getting a replacement. We expect more than that from Vanguard. Four minutes to go. Uh, let's see. What a prize pool. $251. <laughs> so someone uh, spent $2 on the mystery boxes. I didn't even know that could get you a mystery box. Oh. But oh well. Will Cruel win this? I certainly hope so. But yeah, probably not. But we have seen the curse weaken a bit when he won the the Ivia thing and then and then the path of transcendence, right? So yeah. Speaking of decks, I wonder if we'll see an all spider deck. I mean, not all spider, but like, say, 20 spiders and some other stuff. It seems like it could certainly be good. Because when you throw in Mastery of the Ancients, spider actually gets pretty good. And the uh, angelic black and white thing also gets really good because, you, because both of the triggers cost one mana. So with the Mastery, the angel is a two mana, two, two, shielded lifesteal with a one, one. Pretty good value. So, yeah, could work. Black and white all spider deck. Could happen. I'm sure we'll see a lot of the, uh, you know, familiar faces with Mono C, Corruption. Rage Rush, I'm sure, will be in with a new symbol of rage or whatever. The Broccoli deck. Oh, yeah, right. Plants, right? Uh, even though the, the sapling was a little nerfed. Uh, from what I from what I've experienced it, which wasn't a lot, but a little bit, it seemed pretty effective. Uh, even though the plant selection isn't very high, the few plants are pretty good. You've got Death Trap at one mana slot, and then the Treants two mana high. You've got the three three tree as well, but nobody cares about that one. So you want to go with either three energy or five or more to get the best guys, and then just start spamming Treants. Yeah, so hey, with with the valley, we should expect higher quality spellweaver to be played. I certainly expect higher quality to spell. Weaver. Does that mean Cruel Tech's gonna win? I don't know if Divine Offering was the reason he was losing. I don't. I don't think so. Well, we'll see. I'm certainly gonna be uh, keeping a close eye. Make a valley counter. Oh, you mean how many times it gets activated? We could do that, actually. Yes, whenever the valley thing gets activated, that that's a missed DO, which I imagine is going to happen like a bunch of times. Because missed DOs do happen. That's just that's just reality. But, no, I'm, I'm glad the card's in the game. It should alleviate a lot of the frustration that we've been experiencing for a long time. 
So good on you developers for uh, addressing this. Took us a while, but we got there. So now the great deal debate has finally ended. Well, you know, I, I at least I think so. 30 seconds to go. Of course, a reminder to everyone, we'll be going on a 10 minute delay once, once the round starts. So I'll be away for 10 minutes, boo. But then, uh, but then we'll be rolling. So please refrain from spoilers in the future. If possible, that would be great. And uh, good luck to everyone. And may the cruel curse finally end. And we'll finally see that well-deserved title on the crown of the most hardcore Spellweaver player out there. See ya.